Hello viewers, welcome to the SD online classes. Here we are doing class 10 MBSC chapter 10 maths constructions. Name of the chapter is constructions. Page number 235 of your textbook. The exercise is 10.2. The question is like this. This is quite similar to number 3 but the making of the initial triangle is slightly different. Here we have construct an isosceles triangle that means two sides of them are already equal whose base is 8 cm, the third side which is not equal to the other two sides, this is 8 cm and altitude is 4 cm. You have to remember that in an isosceles triangle whenever there is altitude that is 90 degree inside it will pass through the midpoint of this side. Okay, when I'll draw you'll understand what is that and another triangle we have to go into after this, after making the triangle and then another triangle what you are doing is just like your previous question 7 by 5, 2 by 3 like that they have given 1, 1 by 2. What is 1, 1 by 2? 1, 1 by 2 means 2 ones are 2 plus 1 which is 3. So this is one, nothing but this is 3 by 2. Okay. This means 3 by 2. Right. Times the corresponding sides of the isosceles triangle. So let us start how to do it. Okay. So we make the triangle first. How to make the triangle? Make it 8 centimeter. The base is 8 centimeters, so I'll make that side 8 centimeter first till here. 8 centimeters is there. Done. This will be called maybe usually base is called BC, so I'll choose BC. Now you know that there will be A which is equidistant from this two. AB, AC will be same. So before doing that, you are going to make that altitude altitude at the midpoint what is altitude at the midpoint this perpendicular bisector okay which are it is altitude and it is at the middle of the side means that is the perpendicular bisector making perpendicular bisector we have learned many times so this is the making of perpendicular bisector same side no change cannot change cut it here cut it here remove that unwanted part this is not compulsory to remove okay and just to make the diagram look neat I'm doing this so we are going to join these two points this intersection point here this intersection point. okay let us join I'll join only the upper side because I don't need the lower triangle okay I need only the upper triangle so here I'll put the pencil put the pencil but I'll draw only this side No need to join this because we need this triangle. So now this is the altitude I made. But altitude they say it is only 4 cm. So 4 cm altitude is what? Take this from here to here. Remember I am just making the triangle only now. Our work is still remain there. So this is very very same here A. Almost the same point, but not the exactly same. Join this A here. Now join this A with the C. Okay, join. Now your triangle is ready. You know the remaining part of the work now remains. 3 by 2 is your data that you have to understand. Now make this here. How many divisions? Remember. What is this? This is 3 by 2. Okay, why 3 by 2? 1, 1 by 2 is 2 ones are 2 plus 1 is 3 by 2. Okay, that is mixed fraction is written into normal fraction. Okay, so how many cuts we need? I need to cut it 3 times. 1, 2, I can afford to make that gap big because only 3 times I need to cut. So what are they? B1, B2, b3 and you may write it x now what we do in case of 3 by 2 this type of question we used to join this denominator always join the denominator okay denominator is 2 not 3 so this we are joining this we are going to join okay now make this angle equal to this angle how we do this triangle 
this uh, uh, the arc i mean here again another arc done now what is this angle how big is this angle from here to here measure this this is the gap of this angle same size here i need this angle done where it cuts here join it here if you remember extending that line everything is same like question number three i need to join this line here okay and if it is to meet here i need to make it meet here this point will be c dash because this is c this will be c dash now next job is making this angle equal to this angle what is here choose that arc taken choose that another arc here taken what is this gap gap same angle here done this is the point I need to join here. This is the point which will be required to join there. I hope it is okay. Now this will also meet this line very carefully when you are extending the line. Keep this point, keep this point and then only extend this. So this point will be a dash now you have found a dash b c dash which is three times of a triangle of this is two times you can see this is two times this is three times okay so this is how we have finished that now we will write the steps of constructions number one draw b c equal to 8 centimeter now draw perpendicular bisector of BC cutting BC at M usually you can make this M okay next step from M cut m a equal to 4 centimeter then join a b a c then triangle a b c is formed okay no need to write it as an isolated triangle it is understood like that now third step onwards draw angle c b x equal to and n or n acute angle number fourth step cut b b1 equal to b1 b2 equal to b2 b3 on bx done number five join remember we join this one b2 c then from b3 construct angle b b3 c dash equal to b b b2 c done here we can write extending bc to c dash because it was not visible there we extend this line that is also written in the bracket number seven similarly on reaching here what we did from c dash construct angle b c dash a dash b c dash a dash equal to angle b c a b c a here also you did that extending b a to a dash done triangle a dash 
B C dash is the required triangle. No need to write the detail that it is such and such. Okay, it is understood. Thank you.